Kia ora team, my name's Ben and today we're going to look at the difference between a haemothorax and a pneumothorax. First of all, let's have a look at the lungs. Our lungs are surrounded by two layers of glab wrap called pleura and the outer layer is called the parietal pleura and the inner layer closer to the lung is the visceral pleura. Uh, parietal means wall, so it's on the outside closer to the wall of the chest and visceral means organ, so that's why it's wrapped around the organ of the lung. With a hemothorax and a pneumothorax, heme means blood, so this is blood in the pleural cavity, and pneumo means air or gas, so this is when there's air in the pleural cavity. So if this happens, it's going to increase the pressure and cause that lung to collapse if it gets big enough. We have a special type of pneumothorax called a tension neurothorax and this is if we have external trauma um, coming in then we can create this little flap or a trap door and so what happens is we get air that comes into the pleural space and then when we go to breathe out the pressure closes that flap so air can't escape the pleural cavity. With the increasing pressure this is going to collapse the lung and cause pressure pulling over towards the mediastinum, which is the middle part of our chest. So in our mediastinum, we have our heart, we have our great vessels, like our superior and inferior vena cava, our aorta, and our pulmonary arteries. A tension pneumothorax could cause squashing and mediastinal shift where we push over this way. How can these things be life-threatening? Uh, if it's a hemothorax, we can have hypovolemic shock. If it's a big enough bleed, we can lose enough blood to put us into hypovolemic shock. We can also have obstructive shock. Imagine if we've got this pressure pushing over, then it's going to obstruct the filling of the heart and it's going to obstruct the blood flow through those great vessels. So that's obstructive shock. And also, we're going to create a lung collapse. That's going to mess with our oxygenation. All right. Hemo versus pneumothorax. Done. Happy studying, team. Yeah.